It's always great when design can democratize access to essential needs. And today we're in Portland, Oregon, where we're looking at a revolutionary new technology called TrueDent that's fundamentally changing the way that patients access dentures. So Artisan's been in the smile business for almost 50 years now. Yeah, my dad founded the lab 50 years ago and 30 years ago, my sister and I got involved and really developed a passion for dentistry. Dentistry and dentures especially, they're so impactful to people's quality of life. That must be so rewarding. It is very rewarding. However, the number of technicians has shrank over the last 10 years. So now we've had to turn to technology to help us out with that. So historically, dentures have been bespoke objects that are one of one, hand done, lots of labor. Can you take me through that process? For the patient, they have to make multiple visits to the dentist, starting with impressions and bite registration. And each visit invokes other steps here that we have to take care of to ensure fit and comfort. How are you taking these handmade processes and translating them to this computer? Yeah, so we take that traditional handmade process where you've still got three technicians working on a case, and we turn that into a digital file where one technician's working on the case, getting the same great results in a much faster process. So how does 3D printing fit into all this? So with the 3D printing, it's a polyjet system, so it's dispensing little droplets, curing them at the same time. It's a much more accurate process. There's less residual shrinkage, and it allows us to produce faster. TrueDent has allowed us to print a denture in one print, which is very exciting. It's several different colors and shades to match whatever patient needs we have. Customization at scale. Yes. You know, I have to say, I've been in the business almost 50 years and nothing's changed technically on the removable prosthetic side at all. So I'm excited to see something new like TrueDent come in and do a better job than I can. And what a time for this to occur because I can help take the tradition and put it into the technology. So I totally get the benefit of this from the patient and from a tech perspective, but what does this mean for the actual dentist? The great thing is the dentist doesn't need to change anything they do in their clinical protocol in order to benefit from this new technology. Furthermore, if they've invested in intraoral scanning technology in their office, they can utilize that as well. Love that. I mean, same process, same results to more people. That sounds pretty great. How long does it take traditionally to get a pair of dentures made and fitted? If I beg my lab, I'm thinking three weeks. Compared to how long now? Six days without even rushing it. In Bob's case, it was two visits and we were done. And the advantage of this is if a dog eats it or they lose it, I can have another one in two days. I hate when dogs eat my teeth. I'm right there with it. <laughs> I'm a clinical dentist first. I want to do clinical dentistry for my patients. The technology that's coming down from the laboratory side, merging with the clinical aspect of what the patient needs is incredible. The thing about teeth is not only are they functional, but they're also emotional. They're your interface with the world. You change this man's life. It's about quality of life. You know, if you're not feeling good about your smile or your teeth, you're not going to feel good about a lot of other things. 